Welcome to the Lizzie Lizzie Show. Today we're doing a podcast with Milo and a cup of gold. I'm sorry. <laughs> Milo, Milo, we got to show the cup of gold. This is what the cup of gold is. When I say we're having a cup of gold, Milo, I'm going to fall back on this chair. It's, it's this. He's endorsing the cup of gold. It's turmeric, ginger, Reiki mushroom, lemon balm. He's, by the way, he's rubbing up against my hand, which is holding the phone, which is doing the video. Passion flower, coconut milk, cayenne, cinnamon, and black pepper. So when I say I'm having my cup of gold, it's this. With this guy right here. Now, do you like my slippers? He was just sleeping there. But I'm going to go get my cup of gold. Here it is. Ooh, you remember this cup? <laughs> oh, this is the perfect way to have a conversation. Right, Milo? Ooh, Milo. Look at this. Look at this. All right, I gotta get myself comfortable here before we get into our topic. Hold on, I got hair. Let me take a sip. Look at this. See, a cup of gold with some whipped cream and cinnamon. I'm gonna take a sip and you can look at Milo. Mmm, this is delicious. Mmm, really delicious. Mmm, I'm taking more than just a sip, huh? Mmm, this is so delicious. Milo, what do you want? You want some gold? You are gold. You have a golden aura, a golden spirit. Hey, everybody. How you doing? Welcome to the Lizzie Lizzie Show. Today we're doing this podcast with Milo. <laughs> we're going to talk about many interesting things. Many interesting things. It will be in the title of the video what we're going to do. I guess I'll put this cup down over here. That will work. And Milo is here to tell you how fantastic you are, right? And we're gonna discuss how amazing you are. Who is you, you're thinking? You, you and your physical body, your amazing physical body, which contains 37.2 trillion cells if you're feeling lonely today, down today, I want you to remember you have 37.2 trillion cells, trillion, working for you at no cost, free, no charge, trillions. You have 37.2 trillion coworkers, but they're not coworkers. They're your cells. They're the last cell, the last stage of consciousness. Or do you think there's a consciousness after that? After informing you that you have 37.2 trillion cells, maybe now you're thinking, okay, well, Liz, why don't you give me a breakdown of all these cells? Okay, I will. First, we have the basic cell. We have the red blood cell. How many red blood cells do we have? Uh, they take about 25 trillion so we have 25 trillion red blood cells, Milo. Can you believe that, Milo? 25 trillion red blood cells. That's probably a majority of the cells you have. And red blood cells are filled with 65% oxygen, 18% carbon, 10% hydrogen, 3% nitrogen, and 1% phosphorus. Do I sound smart? I'm reading my notes. Next, white blood cells. How many of those do we have, Milo? Seven hundred billion. Why, thank you. Thank you so much, white blood cells. Because without you, I wouldn't have cells that are able to clot and heal me. Isn't that what the white blood cells do? Right? Is that, Milo, you're going to add? Oh, we heard something. Next, we have platelets. We have one trillion platelets. Wow. 
platelets kind of go hand in hand with the 700 billion white blood cells. Platelets and white blood cells, they kind of hang out together. Every time you get a cut, you got to thank those platelets for coming to the rescue along with the uh, white blood cells that help defend against infections. Right, Milito? Right, Milo? Why is he calling you Frank? You're not Frank. You're Milo. All right. You have 640 billion muscle cells. Muscle cells. That's right. Then you have 86 billion nerve cells. Wow. Then you have 200 billion epithelial cells. <laughs> Woo! What do you think about that, Milo? That makes you want to stretch. Um, I am having a session with Milo. He is going to be the smartest cat in the world. That's right. By the way, this is Milo. He is my outside cat. That's his house, if you didn't know. And he came walking out of it this morning. I was very, very pleased and surprised. And we have little mama. She's hissing less and less at Milo. Now, this is a slow process. Every day, I have them kind of look at each other and then go their separate ways. Because it, it takes a while for them to be a company to each other. Also, I got him this collar. You see this collar right here? This was the $60 top of the line collar. And I also got him from the vets something for the fleas that it went bloop. Yeah. Oh, and we got little mama. I'm looking upstairs. She's out the window. You, you wouldn't be able to see, see her if I showed you. Because she's she looks just like Milo, so she blends in. Hey, little mama. Hey, little mama. Little mama, you ready for a boyfriend forever? Don't worry. We'll get him fixed. We'll get him fixed. Don't show the surroundings. All I'm showing is Milo. That's it. That's it. Everyone's here for Milo. Looky, looky, looky. <laughs> it's Milo. It's Milo. I'm doing a podcast with Milo. We're talking. It's a fun show when you get to talk with Milo. All right. I guess all this information is making him tired. So you have connective tissue, that's 200 billion, stem cells, 100 billion, immune cells, 70 billion, and other cells, about 100 billion, are like your fat and your bone. Now, I know that this is the part that you couldn't wait to hear. You want to know how long does it take for your cells to renew? Well, it takes about 125 days for the red blood cells to renew takes one to three days for the white blood cells to renew. Platelets take eight to 12 days to renew. Skin, every two to four weeks, you get new skin. Your gut lining is every three to five days. Now, you can't tell me that coming here is a waste of time because you just realized how magnificent you are because you have 37.2 trillion cells. They're constantly renewing themselves and you don't have to pay them. They don't get a 401k. They don't retire. They're just there to keep you alive. Woo! He found this information very boring. But I got something for him. Are you ready for this? Watch this. Watch this. What's this? What's this? What's that? What's that? You ready? Look, look. Come on. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Ooh, what is this? What's that? I don't understand. It was always going off in the car. Now it doesn't go off. There you go. Ooh. Now this is the part where he adds his part to the show. When you do a podcast with a cat. Come on. Come on. You're not interested? Hey. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go get my gold. Oh, yeah. Hey, cheers to you, Milo. No, Milo. You are the gold, but you're not drinking the gold. Mmm. What a wonderful day. 
Right, Milo? It's the Milo and Lizzie podcast. Whenever we feel like it, we try to make this episode last. Because cats like to get up and walk away when they'll be back. They don't need pay. Just feed them a lot. Oh, look at this. Look at this. You're, you're not here for me. You're here for Milo. All right, Milo, do you have anything to add to this conversation? It is a great, great day. This is your Sunday video. I hope you learned something and you feel appreciative and magnificent about your amazing body and cells that keep you alive and functioning. So you know that you have thousands, thousands of receptor sites on each cell. So every time you take a medication, it's like a key. It locks into that cell. So you got to be careful what you put into your body because our cells are our last stage of consciousness. And consciousness, what is that? What is consciousness? Milo, what's it like to be you? Huh? Tell me. I want to know. All right. That's it for the Lizzie Lizzie show. I hope you liked this little episode and I will see you next time. Have a great day. Goodbye. Meow. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, oh, now you're going for it. Oh, that's the surprise ending, huh? There you go. <gasps> Milo, it's Milo. When you do a podcast with Milo, you never know where the show will go. Don't fall off the chair, Milo. Milo! Have a great day. Goodbye.